A deadly shooting at a California airport in November is now leading to some changes at airports nationwide. More training for TSA agents and more armed officers in airports. North Carolina Congressman Richard Hudson is the top TSA watchdog in Congress, and he told Eyewitness News reporter Kyla Campbell why the changes are needed to protect the passengers. One TSA officer dead, two others hurt, and a passenger injured after gunshots rang out at LAX in November. Now the TSA is changing procedures to better protect people in airports. I obtained this copy of the TSA's recommendations. There are more than a dozen changes coming. First and foremost, the TSA wants officers at all airports to train for shooting scenarios. Transportation Security Chairman Congressman Richard Hudson says that's key to saving lives. God forbid we ever end this kind of situation again. Uh, folks know the appropriate reaction. The TSA also wants more help from local, state, and federal police who patrol airports. The agency is calling for more armed officers to be near checkpoints and ticket counters during peak traveling hours. I think that we should have more police. Do you think you feel safer? I think I would feel safer. On Friday, Hudson chairs a field hearing at LAX on November shooting. They're focusing on the lessons learned and policies that need updates. For example, Hudson says during the LAX shooting, an employee used an airport phone to call 911 but had to run off. But the phone didn't have caller ID, and so the 911 dispatch didn't know which terminal the shooting was happening in. Hudson says the hearing will help authorities figure out an official timeline of the shooting and response, then make sure TSA implements any necessary changes before another tragedy. In Washington, Kyla Campbell, Channel 9 Eyewitness News.